Hi Bear! <laughs> Welcome back to Bearable. Uh, today I'm going to do a video on a few serving trucks that I bought and give you guys my thoughts and opinions on the fit, on the quality, on the cost. Kind of like a continuation of uh, last week's video where I reviewed a few pair of classic shorts. Same concept here. Just going to let you know my thoughts. I got some of these shorts. I got them back in May for a trip that I took. So I've actually been able to wear them out a few times and I actually have a few pairs that I bought last year. So I really have worn those and can give you more of a uh, in-depth review uh, because I've worn these so I will know more of uh, how they fit, uh, which ones are comfortable and which ones have actually lasted, right? Where I've been able to use them again. Let's find out. So the first pair that I'm going to review are the pair that I got from Abercrombie & Fitch. I got these in May for a trip that I took. Um, they are a navy blue 5 inch kind of tie dye print. I'm not sure if you can uh, see that. They actually have these on the site now. I paid $49 for these but they are actually on sale for, for $29 right now. I'm going to leave uh, the links below and you guys can check these out. Uh, they are just, you know, your classic swim trunk. They have the inside mesh uh, underwear type thing, which is what's pretty comfortable. Um, fits really good. They have a, a backside pocket with the Abercrombie & Fitch logo. Not too scandalous. Um, yeah, and they were uh, 49 29 right now. And I also got these in a yellow last year which they actually do have them uh, as well this year. So you can check them out and get them. Like I said, I will link them below. Both of these are in a size extra large and um, they're the same thing, same, same style, different color. And so the second pair is a pair that I got from Amazon from the brand Magmic in a size extra large. These were $25.99 if I remember correctly. I will link them below. Just, you know, your typical classic swimming trunk. Uh, these are described as an 80s, 90s print. Um, also, they have the inside mesh underwear thing. These are more on the loose fitting uh, side. I don't know if these are 5 inch. I could have sworn they were, but when I went back to look, it doesn't say anymore. They're definitely longer than the uh, Abercrombie ones, so these might be a little bit bigger. Um, they also have a, a back pocket. And they have a small little, maybe you can put your keys in here or whatever. Um, so yeah, these are from Magmic. Uh, so the third pair that I got are actually from Lululemon. And I have these uh, in actually a few different colors and prints. Uh, these are a size extra large in a red, um, five inch, have a, a back pocket with a zipper, which is actually pretty convenient if you have anything that you want to secure. And they have this little thing, which I believe is for your keys. Um, the only down uh, fall, I think, or my complaint would be, is the inside mesh to these shorts. It's not comfortable at all. It rises up, you have to constantly be pulling. It's kind of uncomfortable at times. Um, and the price point is on the higher, uh, on the higher end. These go for $78, I believe. I will link them below. They currently, from the ones that I'm gonna show you, they currently only have the red color. Um, they do have other colors other than red, but the ones that I'm gonna show you now, they don't have any of these. I'm just gonna show them to you to show them to you. Um, I did wear these this year. They do feel a little bit more uh, tight, I guess we could say. Did gain a few pounds over quarantine, uh, didn't we all? And um, so they kind of fold from the waistband or whatever a little bit, not too flattering. So I haven't really worn these out again. I did wear them back in May, but like I said, they were a little bit, um, it's a little bit uncomfortable to have that folding while you're sitting or whatnot. Uh, I didn't even talk about the color, right? Um, this is green with the floral print and these are uh, the marble, navy blue, they do go higher than an extra large. I believe they do have a 2XL. I have not bought one of those pairs. I don't know if I'm going to. Like I said, they are a little bit on the more uh, pricey side. So um, they're definitely an investment. And these are a Navy. 
All right, so let's try them on. These shorts fit great, fit nice on the waistline, great length, stretchy, they move with you, they dry quickly. Overall, it's a 10 out of 10 for me. Second, we've got the Amazon Mac Mig. These are great. These are my bloated shorts. These are my shorts that I'm going to go slay a few tacos and go back into the pool. They give you that extra space there. Great length. Nice, nice print. Love these. 10 out of 10. And then we've got the Lululemon that do not fit me anymore. They push up my muffin top, but they're still great. I like them. They're quality. They do not dry fast, so that's another downfall for them. They would be an 8 out of 8 for me. All right, guys, so that brings us to the end of the video um, of the Battle of the Shorts Part 2. I'm going to have to say with the Amazon shorts, they are the most comfortable ones. I think just because they uh, feel a little bit looser than the other pairs. Uh, the inside uh, mesh is also loose. It's not like huggy or uncomfortable. And they just, they feel loose. And I, I like them. They're comfortable. I've worn these a few times now. They are on the cheaper side. Like I said, they're $25.99. So with that being said, they're cheaply made. You can see that, you know, the sewing or whatever this is called, um, it's coming apart. I don't see these lasting uh, for summers and summers. I will probably continue to wear them this summer and then I won't next year. So I guess it's, you get what you pay for. The second pair from Abercrombie, I really like the fit of these. I like the style. I thought they felt really good and true to size. Uh, the, the inseam is a little bit, it's not tight, but it's tighter definitely than the uh, Magmic pair. And But they're comfortable and overall they feel like they're really good quality. Like I, I have the other pair, the yellow pair that I got last year, and they're still in pretty great condition. So I expect these to last me another summer or two. Um, and for the price, even at 49 if you're going to wear them two or three summers, I think you get your money's worth. But they are on sale now, so if you're lucky and you can get them on sale, then that is a great deal. And the Lululemon. They are pretty pricey. The inseam is really uncomfortable. They obviously run very to a size, so don't you dare gain any weight because they will not fit you anymore, which is my case. I have not bought any this year from Lululemon, and I don't think I will. They're great quality. I wore them all that summer many times. I don't see any of the seams coming apart. So they're definitely, I would say, if you're looking for quality clothes that you want to last years, then, you know, spending that extra... Uh, cash that higher price tag is worth it so if i had enough gain a few pounds i would see where where these they're great quality hate the insides but they're good so if you want to buy something that's going to last you a few years then blue lemon is your your go-to but overall i would say the winner for me would be the abercrombie and fitch like i mentioned before i from the past year i have been going up a fan of their clothes, I think their quality has improved, their size uh, inclusiveness has improved, and you can't beat a sale, they always have sales going on, they have a point system for rewards, so yeah, these would be the winner for me. Well that brings us to the very end. Thank you guys so much for watching, I hope that you enjoyed this video and you found it helpful. I also did a video on classic shorts, so find that below watch it let me know what you think if you have any ideas or suggestions on future videos please let me know below comment like subscribe follow me on instagram 773 underscore jesse j-e-s-s-e -S -S -E. until next time bye oh before i forget i know nobody asks but free britney i got this really cool tank at abercrombie and fitch 90s tour t-shirt has a tour dates in the back if you guys are interested i will link it below i believe it's on sale and with that being said peace